guys! Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a really quick video for you guys. It's just a short review of a new product that I recently received and it's the new Tarte Park Avenue Princess Lipstick. I believe it's limited edition. It just came out right now for the springtime. It's the most gorgeous, beautiful, creamy nude that you will ever see. It comes in this little purple package like this with a cursive written Park Avenue Princess logo. It's supposed to go in tune with the Park Avenue Princess bronzer and it's really, really pretty. What I really like about it is how cute it comes. Look at this. It looks like little palm tree, golden palm tree leaves are on the lipstick tube. It's really cute. It feels like a thick cardboard kind of paper. And then it has this gold foil. It says Park Avenue Princess in gold letters. And then when you open it up and you twist it up, it has a gold detail inside and it's just this gorgeous creamy nude. And I thought I'd talk about it because it's a new product. I've been wearing it a lot since I received it. It's a great go-to everyday neutral nude. It's really, really pretty. And then for those of you out there that would like a comparison or a dupe or something that's sort of similar to it, I would say that the L'Oreal Paris in the shade 800 Ferris Nude, which is a cult classic from the drugstore, not necessarily a complete dupe, but a similar pretty nude. I will swatch these for you guys now. And then on the bottom, I will have the Park Avenue Princess, and then on top of it will be the Ferris Nude from L'Oreal. So you can get kind of an idea of what those two look like in comparison. This is L'Oreal Paris in Ferris Nude at the top. And then this is Tarte's Park Avenue Princess at the bottom. So as you can see, this is a peachier, pinkier nude. This is almost like a taupe um, beige nude. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's probably the shortest video I ever made, but I thought I'd get it up here and share this product with you guys. If you haven't checked out this lipstick, go on over to Ulta and have a look for yourself. Swatch it and play around with it. Maybe you'll fall in love with it as much as I did. I can't keep things to myself when I fall in love with something, I just have to share it. So YouTube is a great way to do that. If you haven't already subscribed, don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you in my next video.